Today, all airplanes have round windows. But did you know that this is not just an aesthetic preference? In fact, the design is the result of fatal accidents and painful lessons learned in the 1950s. In the early 1950s, British engineers presented the world with a revolutionary innovation in aviation, the de Havilland Comet. It was the world's first jet-powered passenger airplane. It would close the era of propeller-driven airplanes and bring a completely different speed and comfort to the skies. Flying at 800 kilometers per hour, the Comet was an incredible piece of technology for its time. But one thing was not taken into account, and the disaster began. Just one year after the plane entered service, a Comet en route from Rome to London suddenly exploded in midair. Despite lengthy investigations, the cause of the crash was never found. People were horrified by the crash of the world's most advanced airplane. But 16 days later, another comet, this time on its way from Rome to Egypt, exploded again in midair. The loss of 50 lives brought Britain to its feet. Even Prime Minister Winston Churchill got involved. It was imperative to solve this mystery. And the big mistake was revealed. Engineers built a giant water tank to test Comet's design. How would the plane react to the pressure of being submerged in water? When the experiment began, everyone was shocked. The Comet's angular windows became the weakest point under great pressure. The fuselage of the airplane would tear at these very points. And here was the solution. The windows had to be round, not square because round windows distribute the pressure evenly over the entire surface, not at the corners. After this discovery, round windows were added to the new Comet models. Accidents had destroyed confidence in the Comet. People became afraid to fly de Havilland airplanes, and the pioneer of British aviation went into decline. So who won? Seeing this gap, the American Boeing took over the market by developing jet airplanes. In the end, one big mistake sank one company and put another on top. But airplane windows have now changed forever. If you see round windows on airplanes today, know that this is not an aesthetic choice, but the result of a painful lesson engraved in aviation history.